Okay, Autumn. Whoa! Good for you. We bought a couple of bows for the to do two grandkids. Autumn is uh, seven and Haley is eleven, and uh, they had never shot bows before, so we bought two bows for them. Um, <laughs> Haley being a little older, she could draw a little more weight, so she we bought a compound bow for her. And Autumn, uh, she more or less shoots kind of a stick bow, yeah, pretty uh, easy bow to shoot as well. Good shot. I was just absolutely amazed at how those kids handled those bows. With about two minutes instruction of how to hold the bow and where to put the arrow and where to look and heavens, they were hitting that target like nothing, you know. I, I just can't believe it. I mean, it, just, it came so natural to them. Well, I guess I can believe it because they have good genetics in them. <laughs> and then uh, Rhonda was standing there uh, giving encouragement, so uh, I suggested that Rhonda take a couple of shots because, you know, she was very athletic and she used to shoot a shotgun real well. So I told her what to do with the bow. She took uh, Haley's bow and, well, right off the bat, she just shot like she'd been shooting forever. I, I was pretty well amazed, you know, but no problem. There were three generations shooting, uh, Mike and Leah and two kids, my two granddaughters and myself, and we went out to, to Dundurn to the uh, archery range there at the military camp. There were 3D targets there, plus regular targets there, and we had a blast. The kids really liked it. <laughs> That's a kill shot. <laughs> oh, it makes the whole thing far, far more fun, you know. You, you get to enjoy watching them, and, and uh, yeah, you know, it's, it's, it's a family thing, you know. You're, you're all doing the same thing and it doesn't matter. Their old grandpa's up there shooting and the two little ones are shooting, their mom and dad are shooting. It's, it's, it's pretty darn cool. It's, it's one of the few things where the whole family can do and, and, uh, and compete in and have fun doing.